Hello children, this is your maths class and we are going to start the next chapter, basic operations on decimals, okay? So first, we are going to learn addition and subtraction of decimals, okay? We have learned decimal numbers last chapter, right? Now we are going to learn basic operation that is addition, subtraction, division, multiplication, all that you are going to learn. So the first one you are going to learn is addition. Now for adding or subtracting decimal numbers, convert them into like decimals, zeros at the end if necessary, in order to convert them into like decimals. For example, first you have to, that is when you are adding, if you are given two uh, decimals like this, okay, huh? if you are asked to add them, what will you do? You will make them into like decimals. How? Like decimal means they have the same decimal number of decimal places. Here there are three decimal places. So this you can make into a three decimal place. How? By adding zero. It doesn't change its value, right? Now both are like decimals then you will add it and while adding it what will you do you will arrange for addition I am telling you will arrange them vertically that is uh, you will write one here and the other one also uh, the other one just below them below the first one for addition okay then add or subtract. Uh, Add or subtract the decimal by treating them as ordinary numbers. Now, li like you add ordinary numbers, that is borrowing and every, uh, means you will carry on to the next number like that. Everything you have to do, do it like an ordinary number. See, if you are uh, adding this, this example, you will get 1 here. 1 plus 0 is 1. 6 plus 0 is 6. 3 plus 6 is 9. And... Uh, four, 2 plus 4 is 6. So this will be the final answer you get. So what you have to do? While addition. Now I am telling only about addition. Okay. For uh, addition and subtraction also. You have to convert both. the. If we are given two decimals. They have to be converted into like decimals first. That is if necessary. You will have to add zeros on the right side. It doesn't change the value. Then you will arrange them vertically. Now, if this uh, subtraction is there, the number from which you have to subtract will be on the top. And uh, the number that you have to subtract means minus which one? 4 minus 3 like that. The number which is smaller one will be at the bottom. Then you will do the subtraction. Carrying, carrying and borrowing everything will happen. Same as you do in numbers. Okay, ordinary numbers. Now, let us do an, as an example. Then we will. It will be more clear for you. <coughs> First one is about addition. Okay. Example. If you have to ha add these two. What you have to do? First they have to be converted into this. These are the two numbers. Okay. 149.25 and 121.7. Now, this is having two decimal place. This is having one decimal place. So, this you have to convert into two. So, how will you do? You just have to add one zero. So, you will write it as what? 149.25 plus 121.70. Okay. Now, they are like decimals. Then, you will arrange them one below the other. Now, you will add 5. 5 plus 0 is 5, uh, 5 plus 0 is 5, 9, 9 plus 1 is 10, 0 here, 1 carry, 1 carry here, that means 4 plus 1 is 5, 5 plus 2 is 7, 2. So you got the answer, it's 270.95, okay, so here, first convert into like decimals, 1 below the other you will write, then you will do the addition as you do for ordinary number. Okay. Carrying and all that. Okay. Now in case if you are given three numbers. Three means three decimal numbers. We are learning about decimal numbers. Right. This plus. This plus. Four, five, one point, three, one. Now see. Here, this is having three decimal place. 
this is having one decimal place and this is having uh, two decimal place so this is having three so uh, we have to convert these two also having uh, into decimal numbers with three uh, three decimal places three decimal places this has to be this also has to be changed into three decimal places so first three decimal place uh, number first one i am writing now the next number this one when you convert into three decimal places what will you get you will get 21 now 21 this one just below the zero what has to come one okay this is in the ones place tens place two will be the next one okay now this uh, 21.2 you will write as 21.200 to convert it into three decimal places next one is 451 so this uh, 5 and 2 same row 4 there is nothing on the in that row in the both both the uh, above numbers there is nothing in the hundreds place so write it in the all the places should be in the correct order the places means the one stands place okay one below the other now this is 31 not 31 451.31 right 31 0 you have to write then now all are like decimals now you will do adding 2 plus 0 plus 6 plus 1 is 7 5 plus 2 is 7 plus 3 is 10 0 here 1 you will carry to the front of decimal okay carrying you can do just you put the decimal point here wherever the decimal point is same place you will put it here now when you can you can carry to the left and right okay to the left side also now here 1 plus 1 plus 1 3 7 4 so 473.072 is the sum of three numbers now here three numbers one is having three decimal place you have converted the other two also into decimals with three decimal place so this is about addition now let us do assignment one okay this is based on it this is addition of decimal numbers okay 